Mm, I don't know. Where you coming from? Hey, Ma. What's I was up? out playing. Out playing? Ooh, yeah, I was out there hooping. Playing basketball. I hurt my leg. You know. How's it going? What you doing? Oh, I'm figuring out bills. So, um, I'm glad you came because you know your dad is coming up here. Oh, Mom. Dang. Well, I'm ready for you today. Why not? Dang. What's going on? Hey, Trish. Hey. Hey, Kenny, what's up? Hey, what's up? What's up, son? What's going on? Yeah, Ma, I was up there. I said, what's up, son? What's going on? What's up, man? Hey. Yeah, I'm talking to Mom. You know? It don't matter. This is still your father. Yeah, I know you was talking to Mom, but me and Mom been talking. Actually, we had a couple words about you, so. I'm here now, so I mean, what's going on? What that about me for? Mom? You ain't been here, you know. I'm... I mean, he yeah. has a de- now. Listen, for what we're not gonna do is act like he's a like a deadbeat. Now he wasn't here because he was, and that is, and we talked about that hmm. about you always helping other people. This is where we at. Right. This is where we at, and sure. I'm saying now, and he feels like you're grown, but I'm saying that. I need your dad to talk with you. You're dealing with this girl. She's putting her hands on you, son. I don't want you to flip out. We didn't raise you to put your hand on women, but I'm saying this. After, yeah, after a while, I mean, you ain't going to have no choice because you're going to defend yourself. So what your mom was telling me, um, you know, she hitting you. She playing you. She playing you sideways. You doing this. You in the house angry. You snapping at everybody. You ain't really been yourself. Right. So that, that's what she called me in for. None of the fact that in the Thank past you. is in the past. Me and your mom, you chose to be with your mom. I was a little bit bitter about that because I felt like it should have been more half or more with me. But that's that's behind the thing. Me and your mom talk. So it's all about you and solving your problem. We don't want you to crash out. So talk to us. What's going on? What, I mean, what? You know, I love this girl. I care for her. But... I don't know. I don't think you understand. Pops, you ain't been here. You know, this time I talk to mom about all the time. So I don't feel comfortable talking to you about it. How you gonna understand? You, but you know, but he gonna have because he a man. Not only that, he's your father. I'm a woman, and my my thing is to to nurture. And I want you away from me. You understand what I'm saying? I, I I've done the best that I can, and he hasn't been. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. She gonna help you out from a woman's perspective. Exactly. I'm gonna help you out from a man's perspective. Like when you get caught. And then when you don't talk to your mama, that's why she called me. Because she knows some things you have not talked to her about. And you can only talk to a man. So what better man than your own daddy, your own father? Whether here or not or whatever, I've been here. We just ain't been in the same house. That's what I'm trying to say. So I was from here up. All the way up. You know what I'm saying? So, like, we, we... I understand love. I, I, I do understand that. But foolish love is two different things. You can't do that. I don't care about the kids and you know and all this stuff y'all got involved. It's not healthy. Oh, look, so we, so we I said be there for the kids. I ain't saying you can't be there for the kids. Just look at me and your mom's situation. We had our differences and stuff like that, but we still made sure we take care of the kids. Whether if I was here and she was there or vice versa. That's what we're trying to tell you. Don't stay because of the kids because it ain't healthy, period. Me and your mom she tried to do that. She need me there for the kids to be there in their life. But son, that's what that's what I've been trying to tell you. Then she had a problem with the way I disciplined them. That's what I was trying to tell you. Told me that they felt he came and told me. That hurt my feelings so bad, Kenny, that he had the nerve to come. And I asked him, well, is he coochie with? Right. I don't, what would make you come in and tell me something this woman done said? Because they don't jump on my couch and I they don't want to listen. They gonna listen when they you understand? Yeah. Mm-hmm. But mm-hmm. they don't discipline their children that way. So mm-hmm. it was a problem. But I don't care for her, but I respect her. Right. Right. You understand what I'm saying? So this is where we at. I just feel like you need a man and nobody else. I can't tell you what to do because you are grown. That was your dad thing. You're grown, but you do. I don't care how grown you are. You still need your parents at some point in, in your life. So I'm supposed to just leave her. Just let me apologize for you and your mom feeling like I was taking care of the boys in the community more than I was looking out for y'all. That was Can not, you? I mean... That wasn't my intent. And had I known if I was doing that at the extent of y'all, I would have never been doing it anyway. I felt like I was could do all of that. But seeing your situation and how things are going now, it probably wasn't the best choice. 
but moving forward. Lord, I've been waiting on this for years. Your mom is exactly right. Your issue is me and her issue, and it's overflowing into the house, right? Because you in and out, you know what I'm saying? That's your mom, you're going to be here, the grandkids going to be here, and stuff like that. I need to try to re-enter back into their life, too. Right. So whether we right. apart or whatever, we still the grandparents, and right. we still your parents. So we have to figure that out. We, we we can't have you going down and crashing out, and not being here, either way it, or whatever. So what can we do, son? Be honest. I'm, I'm gonna probably have to sit down and talk to her, and see if she gonna make some changes, you know, and make. Cause I want to be there for the kids at the same time. She using that against me. Like I'm gonna lose her, I'm gonna lose the kids. And I'm like, dang. But I'm that's gonna... not true because we'll fight for your kids in court. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She doesn't even have a job, son. You work in three jobs. She's very disrespectful to you, and I, I've just seen it happen over time. Where it's just blow up. You understand? I don't mm-hmm. know what she's doing. I don't want to speak on that. It's not. I don't want to get too involved where I'm not allowing you to be a man. But I'm saying, we we've been here. We have saw yeah. this. You yeah. understand? It's not healthy for you. Yeah. And you'll be a better parent to me away from that. To see you in a happy space, you'll be a better father yeah. versus being there. Y'all arguing all the time. She's, you know what I mean? Just and assassinating then, your character every chance right. you get. And if you're not in a happy place, you're not doing the kids any justice. Anymore. At all. Look at me. We, I wasn't in a happy place. So that's why I you know, wasn't around as much as I should have. because I wasn't, You wasn't I in, was, a happy, in a happy place? Yeah. No, I'm talking about as far as dealing with the kids and stuff like that. Not the as far as me and you, I'm just saying. I, th- that's another story. The last great say son, wait, no, don't start nothing. Can we here trying to help our son? No, it was going good, but no. But, we, that. Yeah. What, but this is this is a, a milestone for us, yeah. and our love for you. It doesn't matter. We're sacrifice. That has nothing. Our goal is you. That's all that matters to us is you. Yeah. Okay, that's what we're saying. So will you please just talk to your, you know, let your dad talk to you. Why don't y'all go? I wanted to, I'm going to give y'all some money, and I would like y'all to go eat dinner on me, and then I'll get back. You know, y'all let me know. Or is that okay? What you think? I'll do that. Because that's the need to help. I think so. All right. And yeah. then we probably try to sit down, and all four of us sit down and talk about what's the next one. Who, who, the girl? Yeah. You want me to sit down with her? I mean, you hmm. sit down with me. I think you can handle that. Might and she's easy. so disrespectful, but okay. But it's and, about okay. the grandkids. It is. About okay. Same okay. thing you told me. You right. Uh-huh. You right. And she's left out of control. Well, I gotta give your daddy a hug, because I can't believe this. You actually apologize. I've been waiting, what, 10 years for that? Yeah, I still ain't getting no meals. I'm still trying to deal with being in the house by myself. Your daddy, no trying to, your daddy trying to get some butt. That's what that is. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, son. Son, you stay out of that. <laughs> All right. Take care. I love you, baby. Here, go. Um, Meet your dad. All right, I'm about to get up out of here. I'll talk to you. All, all right. right. Yep, I'm going to hit you up later on. All right. All right. All right. Yep. Bye, Trish. Bye, baby.